We're here on Bilborough Road for a video tour of this beautifully presented three bedroom semi-detached family home. Just starting off outside of the block paved driveway here, which gives us off street parking for multiple vehicles, protected by lock up gates. And there's also a further pedestrian gate here too. Driveway also leads to the garage, currently just used as storage. And we have a pedestrian door to a walkway where we can get into the back garden as well. Main entrance door to the hall straight ahead. Front garden is all nice and established and mainly lawn. So we've just stepped inside the entrance hall where we have a really nice low maintenance tiled floor which extends into the breakfast kitchen. Just the door on our right. Straight ahead we have a cloakroom and then a staircase up to the first floor landing where we'll find all three bedrooms in the bathroom. Just a quick look at the cloakroom. Really nice two-piece modern white suite and we also have a heated chrome effect towel radiator. Breakfast kitchen. Really nice range of timber units, plenty of storage. Incorporates a Belfast style sink. It's also a central island too. Space for a breakfast bar and sliding patio doors out to the lovely back garden, which we'll see a bit later on. Just have a look from the other side. Have a further heated tower radiator, as you can see, just next to the door into the hall. In terms of appliances, we have an electric fan assisted integrated double oven. Also incorporates a grill, four in gas hob and stainless steel extractor. And in the outbuilding, which we'll see a bit later on, we have space and plumbing for a freestanding washing machine. Next off, we have the lounge diner. Again, nice low maintenance floor, nice and neutrally decorated. And we have a solid fuel burner set within the chimney breast there too. Plenty of space for a good sized family dining table and chairs. As well as living room furniture. And a further set of sliding doors then take us into the conservatory. Nice and versatile, could be used as a further sitting room or even an office. And we have French doors out to the patio area in here as well. So just up the lovely timber staircase, we have access to the first floor landing. From here, doors lead off to the bathroom. Bedroom number one, useful airing cupboard. Bedroom number two and bedroom number three. Just working our way from left to right, starting off in the bathroom. Really nice four piece modern white suite. We have a shower cubicle with mains pressure shower. Dual flush WC, all mounted wash basin with a heated chrome effect towel radiator, and then a lovely bath with mixer tap. We then have the first of the two double bedrooms. We've labeled this as bedroom number one. Both interchangeable, however, with bedroom number two. Either could be used as the master. Plenty of space for a double bed as well as freestanding bedroom furniture. Lovely views to the rear, and then we also have inbuilt open wardrobes too. Bedroom number two, again, plenty of space for the double bed and freestanding bedroom furniture. Lovely views to the rear again, and fitted wardrobes. And finally, bedroom number three, nice and neutrally decorated. Could be utilised as either a very good sized single bedroom or a small double, currently utilised as an office, perfect if working from home. And just to finish off the tour, a look at the lovely rear garden, initially greeted by a block paved patio area, which gives us plenty of space for garden furniture, which then overlooks the remainder of the garden. To our left, we have the outbuilding, which we mentioned a bit earlier on. Compartmentalized into two sections. Initially, we have a utility area which has a wash basin and plumbing for the washing machine. And is also then 
a further former workshop currently just utilized as storage which has access to both power and lighting could be utilized as an office we then have a useful summer house shed further timber store just to our left that moves on then to a good sized section of lawn all nice and manageable further paved patio area and a variety of established plants as you can see the property just back onto the school playing field as well just a quick look back at the rear of the property we have the conservatory french door access and the breakfast kitchen with the sliding door we also then have a pedestrian gate to the rear of the garage where we have a walkway which can also be accessed from the driveway.